Welcome back, you gorgeous and beautiful people from the internet. My name is Manzi Crypto. Today, we're going to continue on with a little bit more with Starbits. It seems that Starbits is now getting more views than the regular Mobox videos that we make. However, there is a few videos that I still need to make about Mobox, uh, but I'll just do it tomorrow or the day after. I <laughs> uh, just want to show you guys over here that we're sitting on almost 67 cents uh, worth of daily income. And you can see we are on 67,000 pretty much here, 67,500 star. So it, yeah, I, I, I'm literally having the run of my life here with TRX, which is absolutely ridiculous. And I just want to update my numbers over here to show you guys like, uh, you know, the position that we're standing on. So this was this was the number last night before I went to bed. And uh, it was a little bit ridiculous. You can see that we had 2,000, 2,400x wager. Now, the first like three to four hours, we were in a profit. So eventually, when we did did get into the negative, I did write this down. Um, this was I no, it was one o'clock in the morning, right? So when I wrote down those numbers, so yeah, it was twelve hours ago for me in real life, right? It's now. 1 p.m. Uh, so I'm going to just update this number because I'm curious to see what this could be. Um, so I'm just copying these and I'm pasting it here. And you can see that we wagered 21,400. That is absolutely insane, man. In total, uh, if, if we want a 100x wager, uh, we need to wager a total of 22,925. So we are definitely going to beat that uh, before the event is done, uh, which is really, really good. Um, now I'm, I'm still running the same strategy with Kino, uh, but this is the first time ever that I'm testing 1% uh, increase on loss. 5% um, is too much. It doesn't work. It's not reliable enough. 10% is just overkill. And uh, I think anything higher than 10% becomes a gamble. And this is also my wager history, if you guys are interested in that. Um, I'm, I'm just saving the last seven days. So uh, this is TRX. So TRX will be pasted over here uh, next time. Oh, wow. We actually wagered more previously. Uh, but, well, we wagered a lot less. Uh, we're standing on 21,000 now. Um, but yeah, we started with double the amount, wagered, I don't know, <laughs> was that 5x the amount already? Yeah, it's a little bit ridiculous, man. Um, which makes me think my strategy is a little bit too hard. Uh, I'm, I'm betting uh, 2,800 the amount, uh, the, the max amount. That might be a little bit too much, to be honest. Uh, but the goal is to go to zero every single day. And you can see that we're standing on a 37% uh, APR. Uh, and it, it will only get higher from here. I keep telling you guys that uh, it, it keeps getting higher. If you don't put in any more money and you do have enough, let's say, for example, you do okay in an event and you have enough for the next week, you, you will see your APR uh, skyrocket. It's like ridiculous. I, I can see this APR go to 100% eventually uh, over time. So you just have to get to that point where you don't have to invest anymore, but you can still wager in to get into top 100. Uh, the top 100 will keep you at a profit like quite a bit, uh, and it will definitely contribute to your APR. Um, so I do have something to say about this. If I go to my referrals over here, uh, I, I'm getting a ridiculous amount of Litecoin um, and... Well, I wouldn't say a ridiculous amount of this as well, but like, I don't know where this money is coming from, uh, because it is a, right now, we're on a TRX wagering event, uh, but we are getting so much Litecoin and even ETH, like, why am I getting this, uh, to be honest, like, if, if you want to maximize your income, please do not bid anything other than the tournament itself, right? Uh, if you do that, your APR is not going to be as high. Um, 
I, I would instead, in, instead of putting in Litecoin for the TRX event, I would be selling the Litecoin to TRX to take part in the event. It doesn't make sense to wager this much Litecoin for, I don't know who this is. I, I, I'm, I'm decently sure it's Neb, the Nebendel because it's like a, a pretty big Litecoin amount. If, and also you went from 3.1 wager, right? 3.1 wager to 3.5. If you want to maximize your APR, you have to take part in the event. Like, there is no way you're going to make close, not even remotely close to 100% APR if you are not taking part in the event. You're betting Litecoin during TRX events. And that's, not, that's not good. That's not going to help your account. Um, I would, instead of sending the Litecoin to this platform, I would be selling it to TRX and then sending the TRX here uh, to take part in the event. Uh, the reason being is because it will help you again next week to be taking part in that event. And uh, mo most probably you could get three three weeks of uh, wagering events in uh, by doing this. No, I, I do understand you want to wager as much as possible. So you must probably claiming all your funds in one place, right? Let's say, for example, I want to wager Litecoin I'll be claiming everything that I have every single day into Litecoin and that will make uh, the Litecoin as much as possible uh, so that you can wager that in. But again, why wager it in uh, during a non-Litecoin event? It's better to just wait, right? Like, I, I don't know exactly how to explain this, but you're, you're, you're losing APR for absolutely no reason. Uh, when you're doing that. And also, uh, Nebendel, uh, no, Nebendel did wager 3.5. And uh, if I go to transactions over here, and I just change this to, uh, is it tipping? Tipping. Tips, there it is, tips. Just the tips. <laughs> okay, so we did give him three times uh, the five USDT. Uh, tips. So I'm not going to make a video every time he reaches one BTC. Like I'm very, very thankful. Uh, but I'm also writing it down when I donate uh, the five uh, USDT. Uh, the other thing is uh, people want to see the top five people here in my referral. So here's like everyone's referral. Uh, you can see Nimbendal is like way in the lead. Like there's no one even close, right? Three and a half Bitcoin, that's a, a decent amount, dude. That is that is a lot more than I have wagered. So But yeah, here you can see everything. Um Yeah, people are decently close. Like these two, for example, Dirty Freak and Nuggy. They are very close to one another. Um and then, then yeah, he's like fine there uh in, in fifth cal cal fifteen. Um but yeah, there's like big gaps between people, uh, which is understandable. Um, I mean, people have different amount of money and stuff. Uh, so I'm just very thankful for you guys being here, man. Like, I, I really do appreciate that. Uh, we're getting a decent amount. You can see that I made uh, almost a thousand star today. But it's because Nibendal went from, I think, 3.01 BTC wager to 3.55. And it looks like it's mostly just Litecoin because that's roughly eight to nine dollars. This is maybe nine dollars that I'm receiving here. Um, so I think it went absolutely ridiculous on Litecoin again today. <laughs> so yeah, I, I would just say stick to the events, man. If the events say TRX, they're not wager anything other than TRX, or at least wait for let, wait one more day where it says here you could make bets in any, like with any crypto in any game, right? Like rather wait for this event then and you'll be actually getting something in return. But just doing it to wager it in, I don't think that's good enough. You will most probably not get uh, the APR that you're hoping for. That is just my opinion. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for taking time out of your day watching this channel. I really do appreciate love and support. If you did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll catch you beautiful people in the next one. Love you, take care, and as always, remember to twist some nips. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>
Bye, have a great time.